why you're here, so let's get started on how I achieve these curls. For this look, I'm going to be using Fortified Naturals products as my base. I'll be using their leave-in conditioner, and as my styler, I'll be using their Intense Hydrating Potion. I started on stretch hair. I had put my hair into twist after I washed my hair and then let it dry so my hair could be dry and stretch for this style. And the reason why I like starting on stretch dry hair is because it makes drying time so much faster. So I applied the leave-in conditioner, making sure there's no tangles in there, and then I'm going to section off my hair and get ready to roll. And don't forget to check out the description box below. I will leave all the info on the products I use down there. Now I'm going to spray a little bit of water on my hair, just enough to add a little moisture, but I don't want to add too much so my hair reverts back. Next, I'll be applying the Intense Hydrating Potion, about a nickel to a quarter size amount to my hair. So starting at the root, I'm going to twist and roll my hair onto the perm rod. When I get to my ends, it is a little difficult, I'm not going to lie, I had to add extra product because I'm not using a gel, so it makes it a little bit more difficult for my hair to stay on. So I added that extra product to smooth out the ends so it could stay secure enough so I can secure the perm rod. And if your hair just keeps unraveling on the rod, it's okay. Just keep trying again, add a little bit more product. But I'm gonna show you again here. So add a little bit of water and then apply your product. Make sure there's no tangles in your hair and your hair is nice and smooth, ready to rod. And then starting at the root, you're gonna twist and roll your hair down the rod. And once you get to the end, if you have enough product, just nicely smooth your hair onto the rod. If not, add a little bit of product to the ends and smooth it on. Just keep smoothing it. Once it feels like it is staying and not unraveling, secure the perm rod. And I get this question a lot on how to make my perm rods nice and tightly secured. You want to make sure the band is going over the root. So when you're securing the perm rod, make sure that band that you see there is going over the root when you secure your perm rod in place. All rolled up. I used about 24 perm rods. I'm going to let that dry overnight. Now my hair is nice and dry. Make sure even if you start, start on wet hair, make sure your hair is dry or you will deal with a lot more frizz. So now I'm going to unravel the rods. It's going to take some time since I did use 24 rods. But look at this bounce though. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Once you are done unraveling the rods, you are going to separate the sections of hair. I'm going to separate it about four to five times. You can add oil to your fingers to avoid frizz, but the product that I use is very moisturizing and I didn't feel like I needed to add any extra oil or anything like that. Now time to add some volume. And here are the final results, gorgeous moisturized curls. It's almost a cheat to a Bantu knot, so if you don't like doing the Bantu knots or you don't know how to, this is a different method you can try for similar results. I hope you guys liked the video. Be sure to subscribe, leave a comment below on what you guys thought and what you'd like to see, and I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.